This video is part two on the Flatbridge saga with the mermaid. The man who visited Flatbridge who was sitting on the rock. He's gonna speak now why he visited Flatbridge. Listen carefully. Remember, people, where they say no mermaid, mermaid, this is him sitting on the Good rock. Good morning, definitely. I'm here to explain uh, how I got the feeling to go by these places, historical places, I want to go back there several more times again, you know. But out by Flatbridge, you know, it's a whole different thing going on out there, you know what I mean? In most cases, I'm out there to, to purify the bridge and, uh, you know what I mean, relieve things from this issue, you know, paying the ancestors coins and letting them remember that, uh, I am here and I'm not ungrateful. I do remember you guys for what you have done and what you have left behind and the entitlement which you give us to use these things what you have created for us, the bridge, you know, and especially some of these guys or most of these guys were buried beneath the bridge so they didn't have the time to have a proper burial. So, you know, you know, spirits are very rebellious and all of that. So I'm saying that I'm um, giving them the time out to know that I remember that they are there and I appreciate what they have left behind for all of us. And uh, in most cases, guys who go out by Flatbridge to wish for wealth or drop kinds for luck or drop kinds because they want to find a girl of their life. No. For me, it's not that, it's not that, or it's not any other issue, you know what I mean? For me, what I wish for you now is just to know that my family have a long life, my friends have a long life, even people I may not know have a long life, and we can overcome this whole scenario which they call a COVID, you know what I mean? So all of the things that, you know, dear, dear, it's not godly, you know, but, you know what I mean, shit happens, definitely. And this is what happens when I first attempt out to here, as if to say that, you know, in a spiritual realm, in a vision where most people call a dream in Jamaica here, you know what I mean, uh, I woke up one morning and on the bridge, you know. I don't know how I got there. I went to my bed. I was like, this is a dream, this happened, right? Uh, I woke up one morning, you know, on the middle of the bridge, right, on the white line itself. And I was wondering what's happening, but I thought I was still in my bed. So, you know, white line here, I felt the rock tough on my hair. I was like, there's a pillar. So I well, dry my hand up and I get my hand through the bruise on the ground and stuff. You know what I mean? But what was so upsetting about the whole entire thing? When I was lying there, you know, I heard when the breeze, or should I say the wind, I heard when the wind blow and rock the the bamboo trees. Yes. I heard when the wind rock the bamboo trees and uh, it was so peaceful. You know the trash blew across the road. You know, there was no car in sight. There was absolutely nobody inside. It was just so much peace and tranquility. For that moment, till out of the break of silence, I heard a splash of water. And I went over and looked over the bridge. There was a beautiful lady in the bridge, you know. So the lady was lying in the bridge. No, I was swimming with so I saw the lady in the water, sorry. Now I looked over the bridge and I saw the lady over. Uh, the bridge in the water was like, wait, miss, come out the water, you can't swim. You know, she's like, no, she can't swim. You know what I mean? So she's like, no, she can't swim. Me can't swim. So I'm like, no, me can't swim. So she's like, I joke, I can't swim, I can teach her. So I'm like, no, I'm not teach me not to shut up, Bob, because 
I ain't coming in that water and a lot of people dying out here and shit, so you're too beautiful. Don't waste yourself like that, you know? If you want a man, I'll be your man. Come on, don't waste all that. You know, darling? Girl, damn, girl, looking fine. <laughs> She's laughing and thing, and you know what I mean? It was like, yo, come on, water and shit. But something distract me on the other side of the bridge where I turned my face to the land up in the hills. You know what I mean? Uh, I saw some rock, you know, really slipping. Uh, that. But when I turned around back to see where she was, she was completely gone. She was completely gone, and the water was completely gone. It was completely sand. It transformed into sand. So as if the ground, which was not there, is now there, and then you know went on the head, which I was sitting right there. You know, I'm going over the computer. I used my foot and I stamped. I mean, just to check out what's happening here because it's supposed to be water over there. So I'm like, interesting, where the water is, the water transformed into a sand. And then I was like, really? So I went on it. Honestly, I went on it. And uh, from I went on it, I was there walking around. And I said to myself, well, I'm the second person who walk on water. Jesus the first man, now me second it. And I said something curious about this, it's just not making any sense. You know? I know it's supposed to be water, so how come this is just sand? You know what I mean? So I was like, all right, let's test the will of this. So I stuck my finger in the sand. There I saw a hole. A hole, you know, where you make with your finger. But what was strange happening to that hole, you know, all the sand keep filling in the hole, filling in the hole, filling in the hole, and it's non-stop. So I was like, but well, wait a minute. It's not going to fall on me, going to fall all the way in this whole business. Yeah, so she come close to me, wrap her tea around me, and then I she come hug me up. It's like I feel warm. I buy she let me go. She said, she pray. I mean, I wonder how that. And by the time, you can float up at the top. Obviously, I look at you, mermaid, so like, but I picked the company, I can't give a jacket. She said, I hear a pit and I said, no, man, I feel like that is too pit and can't burn so fast. One should be in and come out and pit and burn, you know, you know, you know. And she said, yeah, man, I need to go home, oh, I think my friend. And I said, oh, I think, no, you're a thing, my friend. And yeah, yeah, I'm a big friend, I'm a woman. So then I said, you know, this thing and I add up to me. You can't go up now. I'm from a go, I wake up. I said, I wake up, check up. I will not even wake up in my real bed now. I wait from my head to my toe like you come out of one pool and just go lay down in your bed. I saw the whole entire bed soaked with water, my pants soaked, my shirt soaked, as if my master was spent so much. But the soap from my head, I could have ring out and I hear them for sure with water and I ring out. So I said, I'm going to go and get a boy or something. Yeah, man. I did. From that day, I find myself a boat here. This is from the field of bridge when I have a deep nightmare there, you know, where I go under water and I can't swim, you know. But many times, you know, go to the pool and start finding myself water come in in my house. You know, when I have dreams in my room, and the water just come up like, you know, when I mean, was a rat in the world. Many times the water come in, you know, so you have a time to come up on the sea, so you know, yeah, you know, so you take to the lamp and go to the moon, and I go find myself and I get down to the jacket and I get down to the jacket and I get down to the jacket and I get down to the yeah, man, very scary and dark moment. You know what I mean? Trust me. But I'm alive. That means they don't want to keep me. I'm doing the right thing. But they don't want a bag of cow. They don't want a bag of Christian. They don't want a hobby man, especially a hobby man. Yeah, they have come create a bag of seeds. Yeah, yeah people, that's him right there throwing the coins in the water. I had a video up on it and. People were contemplating there's no mermaid in the water, there's no this. So you hear from this handsome gentleman why he have to go there to do what he was doing. That is him and the rock there, people. Yes, people. What's your thought on it, people? Let's talk about it. Yes, people. I believe him. Yes, I don't know who don't want to believe, but I believe this man. Something no normal a frat bridge, something no normal. And a lot of beautiful girls die over that place. 
the spirit don't rest. And people say that there's no mermaid there, mermaid. Mermaid is there. Who wanna believe, I don't wanna say there's no mermaid. Mermaid is in that water and most of the time that's why so many accident people people crash there and the spirit don't rest. 